Hey everybody, it's Joanne from Artsy Light Tarot doing a check-in for the sign of Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Tap into the energies that surround you at this time. Spirit, please show me the energy that surrounds Aries. Cross watchers, you're also welcome here. Just remember to flip the rolls, okay? What is the energy surrounding Aries at this time, Spirit? What is the message? Someone's watching you. Page of Swords energy. Sneaky. Fake profile. Hiding from you behind the scenes. Social media. There is an energy of someone that is attached to you from the past. Ravenous. Uncontrollable desires. Appetite for sex. Insatiable hunger for pleasure. So this person's possibly addicted to sex. This person is spying on you. This person has a lot of sexual um, feelings towards you. Is thinking of you sexually, Aries. Please clarify this message for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Please clarify this message for Aries, Spirit. What do they need to know at this time? Please clarify this message. Eight of Cups, someone that you've walked away from, someone that was not capable of loving you to the, to the fullest extent with the Eight of Cups, right? Ten of Cups is, is ultimate in regards to love and emotion, this person wasn't able to satisfy that. So you moved away, possibly an uh, Pisces energy, someone that you did have a lot of love for, someone that you had to walk away from because they weren't giving you what you deserved. You had no choice but to walk away from this person. But this person's still very energetically attached to you, spying on you, and still have a lot of em sexual emotions for you. And I feel that's the, the capacity of this person as well. This person's not capable of loving from a soul connection, from a soul place. This person's only capable of loving in the physical, right? So they have confused sex with love, this person that's still energetically attached to you at this time, right? Any other energies for Aries? The tower, yeah, you walked away from this person because there was a major disruption within the cycle. There was a breakdown in 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 the stability in in the foundation of this connection. Something really shook your world, Aries, and you had to walk away from this person because they're very deceptive. You didn't see something. There was something that was hidden from you. And spirit is saying that they had no choice but to shake this up because this was not your destiny or path. You were being treated in a way that was not right or fair. You were dealing with a player, right? This person that thinks sex is love, that goes around giving their want to others and multiple people, not just of their of one gender either, I feel so inclined to say. So you are walking away be, be, and you had no choice but to walk away because spirit is acknowledging that there was, this was not an equal give and take, right? Because there was something you didn't see clearly in regards to a player, possibly a Pisces, again, a lot of water, someone that you had a lot of feelings and emotions for. This person was keeping you stuck. So spirit shook things up for you, Aries, because you had to, because there was no happiness moving forward with this person because this person was not on the same vibration as you with the knight of uh, wands right and then the hangman is indicating that the, this person is very stuck as well and was keeping you stuck this person's very selfish. This person's still energetically connecting to you via the sneaky card, whether it's through social media. I feel that you no longer have connection with this person, but spirit is acknowledging this person still thinks of you sexually and is spying on you. This person's very selfish with the nine of cups. This person's also dealing with addictions, possibly through alcoholism. This person is not healed with the nine of wands in the reverse. This person's still um, very self-absorbed and drowning their feeling. They're not facing their demons and they're still clinging to you with the death in the reverse Scorpio energy, not dealing with their karma and still being stuck. Okay, so I'm going to clarify this energy for you now, Aries. Please clarify the Eight of Cups spirit. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Thank you. Ten of Wands in the reverse, Sagittarius energy. You are walking away and releasing this burden. This is not your burden to carry. This person's not wanting to face their demons. That is not for you. Spirit is acknowledging you must disconnect and continue to walk away. This is not for you to carry any longer. This is not yours to carry, Aries, I feel inclined to say to you. We had, oh shit. Please clarify the tower. Eight of Swords in the reverse. 
this person because they were so deceptive within the connection. It was necessary for spirit, for the universe to destroy, to, to, to break down that which was not stable, stable. And now you're healing from that. And I feel that made you feel stuck for a long time because this person was so deceptive in the connection. They made you, they blamed you for a lot of things, right? They were very okay with allowing you to, to feel like you did, you were a big part of, of this destruction when in fact it was this person that was not willing to face their demons. So now you are recognizing that you're releasing this burden and you're no longer carrying the mental anguish that this person brought into your life. You're not carrying the mental scars that this person's manipulation and lies caused you, right? This person was savage. Please clarify the sum in the reverse. Yeah, they want, they gaslit you and they don't share your morals and values. Spirit had to break this up, right? The, the hair font in the reverse. This is someone that you're possibly divorcing. You've divorced someone that you were in a very serious commitment with, possibly lived with no longer, right? You've disconnected from this person because you now see them clearly. There is no happiness with this person. This person is not capable. You do not share the same morals and values, right? There is, you are not at the same vibration at this as this person. This person's very dark right? With the hair font in the reverse. I feel this person's tied up with some really dark energies as well with the ravenous card, right? This person thinks that sex is love. This person's very empty. And this person's probably possibly tied up to someone else that's also, um, that kind of took them away from you with sex. This person is very driven by their uh, wand, all right? This person is very guided by their sexual desires. They have a lot of addictions, and I feel that they're very wanton in sex. They have a lot of secrets in regards to sex as well, Aries. Please clarify the Knight of Wands, Spirit. Please clarify, thank you. With the High Priestess in the reverse, yeah, this person has a lot of secrets. The Knight of Wands being clarified with the High Priestess. So that's indicating that there was a lot of secrets within the connection. More secrets than you even can possibly imagine. Like I said, I'm picking up a lot of downloads in regards to this person. This person has a lot of secrets. This is someone that you did have a lot of love for, though. I feel that, right? Unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, and attraction. But this person was not able to reciprocate that, Aries. This person does not know how to love. This person thinks sex is love. And they're always on to the next one. So you can't grow old with someone that's that's jumping from the next to the next to the next, right? Someone that's very superficial. So that is why the spirit broke down this relationship because there is no future. Not in the way that you are looking for, Aries. Not in the, the soulmate connection that you are looking for. Any other messages for Aries spirit? Anything else? No. Okay. I'm going to close out this reading now with a moonology for you Aries so spirit please close out this reading with a message for Aries Sun Moon Rising Venus what is the final message thank you so much for all your support on my channel I appreciate it please uh, like subscribe comment let me know if it resonates check out my YouTube my TikTok I also offer personals and we'll leave that information in the description box below okay so it's time to take a breath out all right. So spirit is acknowledging that you've been through a lot, but the, I feel the worst is behind you, Aries. This person is still watching you. This person is still sneaking, um, watching you through social media. Um, and this person's still very much connected to you, but spirit is telling you it's time to release this person, continue to have your boundaries and recognize that you are not of the same vibration at this person, but spirit is letting you know that they are still very energetically connected to you at this time. Thanks Aries. Appreciate you all. Bye.